know we should not see color. Sure. You know what I'm saying? But the truth is we step out into a world that does see color and they have their preferences. And you can say, oh, no, we're all we're all. No, we're not all. Because <clears throat> I was having this this talk with, with you know, this why do we play basketball with? And I'm like, bro, what are you? You're an American, right? What am I? African-American, mm. right? That Hispanic dude, he's Mexican-American. She's Asian-American. There's an adjective between e before each and one of our identities that lets you know that you're, the, you're a real one. They put something in front of mine to let you know that I'm different. Wow. So when you say that I've caused the division, yet you call me an African-American. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Wow. Like, how is that wow. me? I'm not causing division. I'm dealing with the division that exists. Wait a wait a radio. radio. I feel like we need to talk about this, and not just because it's a it's a hot topic, but I think you have uh, just a perspective that I think people really care about, man. This is all this police brutality and all this stuff we're seeing in our cities, bro. And it's it's almost happening at a rate now that it's like you can't even keep up with how many police killings there are, the facts with all the cases and all of the stuff, man. Um, man, just some general thoughts from you, man, on just um, the state of affairs of our country right now, brother. I don't know that it's happening at a, a, any faster of a rate. We just finding out about it. I more. think now everybody has cameras on their yeah, phone. Yeah. Yep. So now we're starting to see the stuff that we've been saying has been going on. Yeah. And people have been acting like we've been seeing things and making up things and saying, nah, you know, it's not that bad. And and now it's like you have cameras, you got footage, and people are still saying, nah, you're letting the media. Like, that's the, the issue I've been having is, that one, it's not with the world, it's with Christians. Yeah. Um. The fact, the, the audacity that some people have. I've had somebody tell me that, you know, the the racism and the, you know, the uh, injustice, that's a myth. Quit buying into that myth. Wow. Everything's equal now. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Like, I was like, bruh, for, for few, before we even had this conversation, bruh, don't call my pain no myth, homie. Right. Like, right. that's starting this conversation off so wrong. Because you're telling me that, yo, you're buying into the media and you're letting them. I've been black for 33 years. Yeah. What do you mean? You get it from the media. I get it from experience. I can tell you stories about me. I guarantee you half the people over there can tell you stories. I have guns pointed at more guns pointed at me by police than gangsters. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Wow. Never been to jail. Wow. Innocent. Wow. I ran. A, they say I didn't come to a complete stop. They coming up behind me or doors swinging open before they even stop. Guns on me and my cousin sitting on the curb, ripping my car up, locking me, uh, strapping me in the, uh, in, the, in the back seat with cuffs on. You know what I'm saying? Looking for something. Asking me if I got a, 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 a anybody in the trunk, any dead bodies in the trunk. Sheesh. Like, harass, bruh, I've been through mad stuff. With, and people got way worse stories than me. So when you tell somebody that, it's it's fake and what they got they got from the media i didn't need the media to tell me anything yeah. this has happened recently as a christian rapper you know what i'm saying i've been in freaking <laughs> we was, i was going up to i was going up to creation fest bro mm -hmm. in harrisburg i pull into an empty freaking hotel mad parking spaces in the hotel front of the hotel i go in there we don't have any rooms wow you know what i'm saying i leave police follows me out of that parking out of that uh hotel follows me follow he's following me so long that i pull into a gas station where there's light because i don't know what he might try to do right you know what i'm saying i want people to be able to see so i pull in where it's light he pulls up on the side and you know I, I try to tell him yo he, he's like where you going like we're looking for a hotel room. It's not. It's late at night. I'm tired. You know what I'm saying? You were just at a hotel. They said they don't have any rooms. They have rooms. They have a lot of rooms. I'm like, well, she told me they don't have any rooms, bro. You start asking me 21 questions. You have guns. You have weapons. Oh, you're a Christian. What denomination are you? Well, why wow. are you driving up there through here? Why didn't you just fly straight there, bro? You know what I'm saying? That's crazy, bro. <laughs> 
I took my first breath, my first at creat- breathalyzer at creation, going to creation <laughs> you know fest, dog. going to creation that's fest, crazy. Bro, the and I know that area Harrisburg well, bro. That's crazy, bro. So it's like when people say, and then the, then you have statistics. You know what I'm saying? Like numbers so, don't lie. Yo, so you know it, it it hurts to have someone not to just brush off your pain. Yeah, and I think that the biggest the 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 most important thing is to acknowledge acknowledge like me there's a lot of people you might not know but me i get on black on black crime sure. more than half the people you probably listen to you know what i'm saying i address these issues in the hood all the time you got you y'all y'all applaud it you clap you say amen you you feel like i have so much wisdom in my bars the moment I say that they, they speak on racism or racial injustice, a problem. you act like all of a sudden my wisdom has gotten snatched out of my <laughs> head and I'm just such a fool and I'm so blind. No, I'm the same dude that, that God allowed to speak into your life before. Yeah. I didn't just get stupid. I'm just telling you about something else now. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And um, it's, it's hard, man. <laughs> it really is hard, but the the truth is the truth and and people have to see like there is a difference no we should not see color sure you know what i'm saying but the truth is we step out into a world that does see color and they have their preferences and you can say oh no we're all we're all no we're not all because <clears throat> i was having this this talk with with you know this why do we play basketball with and i'm like bro what are you you're an american right what am i African American, mm. right? That Hispanic dude, he's Mexican American. She's Asian American. There's an adjective between e- before each and one of our identities that lets you know that you're the you're a real one. They put something in front of mine to let you know that I'm different. Wow. So when you say that I've caused the division, yet you call me an African American. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Wow. Like, how is that me? I'm not causing division. I'm dealing with the division that exists because I have to fill out a paper and let you know that I'm not like you before I even try to get the job. (laughs) You know what I'm saying? Bruh. Like, I don't know, bruh. And and people people don't see it. Man, they don't. How do you, how do you, uh, what are some steps, man, that need to be taken to, 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 to help solve some of this stuff, man? The conversa- I think the conversations need to continue to be had. It's just I think that con- uh, people, some people say we don't need to talk about it. I think this that's one of the best things that's happened to this because it's like people got to admit there's a problem first, bro. They have to, they have to, and it. But man, it's just a, it's a. I think that's the first thing. As long as we can acknowledge that there's a problem, yeah. We might all come up with different solutions. Yeah. But if we can't agree that there's a problem, then that means what it what it boils down to is the problem doesn't affect you enough to want to deal with it or care to deal with it. Mm. But it affects me in a way that I have to deal with it whether you whether or not you want to or not. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. When my when my son say, Hey daddy, or the the police are the good guys, right? I couldn't with a clear conscience tell him yes. All police are the good guys. Man, I could not. I, I was like, yeah, they're they're supposed to be. Yeah, they should be the good guys. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. A lot of them are the good guys. A lot of them, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. But from my experience, I've had. I ran into a lot of cool ones. I ran into, you know what I'm saying, and power corrupts. <clears throat> it, it, it so. And I don't know if the, if we feel the same when we get pulled over. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And whether or not you feel like how, my fear is justified, that's another conversation. But don't tell me it don't exist. Yeah. Man, yeah, bro. <sighs> Biz, man. This is so complex, dog. It's so many layers, bro. And you're dropping this knowledge right now, dude. My God, man. I didn't know you had the situation at Creation Fest. I'm still tripping about that, bro. Like that's that's blowing me right now, bro. Bro, I t- this was, I was before out here. after you performed. No, that was on the way up to oh, Creation no Fest. Up, man. Wow, bro, like it's still alive and, and well, and it's more than on a. What we're not talking about is 
racism on a personal level. Sure. We're talking about on a systemic level. Yeah, that's a system. You know what I'm saying? That's like, a system. Like my, my dude Voss says, he's like, <laughs> I don't care if you call me the N-word and I get the loan on the house. I don't care if you call me the N-word and I get the job. You know what I'm saying? This is not calling name calling. We're talking about we're talking about statistics that show where where a Hispanic person has taken his application, sent it out, got no hits, then he changed it. He he put his name in English instead of his Spanish version of his name and got mad calls back. Like wow. So when we're talking about something that can keep you from pro- but buying houses, and that's we have to deal with the fact that the past affects the present. Sure, you know what I'm saying. If there was a time, in in our near past, black people could not buy homes, right? You can't negate the fact that when we could not buy a home. Your grandparents and great grandparents had homes, bought homes, and 200 years later, or not even that, 80 years later, you're making two, three, four hundred thousand dollars on this home if you sell it. Yeah, four thousand. You're four thousand, four hundred thousand dollars ahead yeah. because you bought a house when I couldn't buy one, and now you're selling it when I can buy one. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. So just little stuff like that, bro, is like that people take for granted. Yeah. Trust you know what funds, I'm all of that stuff, bro. Wait a wait radio. radio. radio.